I mean, I hope y'all can see me. Um, I don't know how the connection is going to be out here. Smash that like button. We are currently outside. As you can see, Trump will be coming in through there. Uh, Jose Alba, who went through a case where he was sent to Rikers Island after a self-defense case by District Attorney uh, Alvin Bragg. Uh, Trump is making a political chess move as he is showing up to the hood. Um, RSBN is on the other side, right side. Broadcast Network is on the other side. Trump representatives. And then as you can see, everything is barricaded throughout. A bunch of people on this side, a bunch of people on that side. And uh, once again, I'll be uh, taking you guys through. As you can see, the media is right here. We got a, a couple anti-Trumpers, uh, a young lady with um, an anti-Trump uh, sign tried to get in, tried to sneak in. So we'll see exactly how it goes. So let me know if y'all can hear me. This is what it's looking like. Um, Trump should be coming in from there. He should be walking right into the store. That's the media on that side. And as you can see, the media on this side as well. So I'll try to be on live stream. Um, I spoke to the hood. The hood is outside today. The hood is for Trump. Um, the hood is Jack and Trump. I want to probably get a couple people from the hood to talk to me. But again, I want to show you what it's looking like out here. The sun is blocking it, but I want to show you what it's looking like. Everybody has come out. Everybody is expecting Trump. There's barricades, there's secret service everywhere. Um, and everybody is outside for Trump right now. Once again, I want to go through some of the media. I want to go through some of the people in the media. Maybe I'll give you guys a better look from here. How you doing? Come on, that. Uh, Trump viene a las. Yo creo como como en 20 minutos, 15 minutos por ahí. I could be wrong. I don't know. Tú lo estás esperando. ¿Estás esperando a Trump? Claro. You like Trump? Yeah. Yeah. Por eso tiene tres horas aquí. Yeah, no, it, it takes a long time. He's the, you know, he's busy. Tenía corte. He had court today. So. Let me get some of the media here. Yo, I got a quick question for everybody here. I, I saw some of y'all don't like Trump. Raise your hand if you don't like Trump. Don't like Trump. Okay, so we got we got the anti-Trump crowd, which they're always welcome, of course. You don't like Trump at all. Fuck Trump. Yo, who's Trump 2024? If he gets you... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, hold on, we, we gotta run that back. If Trump gets you in there, you, you'll vote for him. But, you'll say it, okay, but you won't vote it. <laughs> well, what can you do? So once again, you got signs up here, and then you of course have... Oh, ¿Ustedes quieren a Trump? ¿Ustedes son dominicanos? ¿Ustedes quieren a Trump? Dígame por qué. Lo Why? Amo, lo amo. Porque hay dinero, hay trabajo. Hay dinero, hay trabajo, hay policía, hay de todo. Hay de todo. Claro. So we got the Dominicans are for Trump, and then we got some of the our white liberal friends over here. No, hell no. White, she looks like a white liberal from, from the Heights. <laughs> it's all love, though. It's all love. Oh, it, yeah, this is what it's looking like out here. It's a lot of fun. Why can't you have fun out here? You have to have fun out here in these streets. Um, I told you how I deal with New Yorkers. Everybody's the same to me. It doesn't matter. Um, RSBN, once again, is on this side. RSBN is on this side right there. Once, once again, that's a bunch of Secret Service. Trump's campaign. Um, and yeah, Trump should be coming from that side. Uh, we got a good crowd, so can you guys hear me? Let me know, man. My connection might be uh, crooked a little bit. Yo, yo, I see, I see y'all waiting. Are y'all waiting because y'all y'all like Trump, or y'all waiting because y'all want to say fuck Trump? You, you fuck with Trump all day? Yeah, like I said, it's a mix. It's a mixed reaction. The only people in the back 
Only the people in the back over here don't really like Trump. She look, she got a mask on. You know she definitely don't like Trump. <laughs> Let me see. I'm gonna try to get some more clarity here. Let me walk through. Sure. Sorry about ahead, that. Man. Sorry. Yo, I'm live streaming. I got a couple thousand people. Yo, what's up? We here. What's up? What's up? Trump coming to the hood right now to talk to Jose Alba. Y'all fucking with that? I was talking to them earlier. They actually from out here. A lot of people. Uh, just so happened to be out here at the time the barricades came through, but these guys are from out here. They from outside. So what? So, is it Trump 2024 or Biden 2024? Yeah. Free Young Thug. Free Young Thug. Free Slap. I'll try to get through real quick. Try to get through, brother. I'm sorry. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You was out there? Yeah, I was out there. Okay, okay. I think I saw you. Yeah. yeah. yeah Lou, Lou Valentino, Lou yeah. Valentino, all right. Yeah. <laughs> nah, Instagram. I mean, uh, YouTube, YouTube. I don't even know what platform I'm on. <laughs> this is uh, Trump will be going in there into that store. Uh, that's the Jose Alba store. I, I will. I, I'll get everybody's perspective on why they don't like him. I think that's always more interesting. Um, shout out to the Young Republicans Club. Um, they um, they got me in here today. I can't lie. Without Gavin and Vish, I would not have been in here. So, um, as you can see, Gavin right there. Young Republicans Club doing their thing out here in New York. Uh, we're gonna try to get. Hopefully, Trump comes to the Bronx for a rally. I think that would be amazing. Let's go, Trump. See, we outside with it, man. So once again, that's Gavin. That's who's uh, that's who got me in here. Yo, Gavin, I'm streaming. I want to say thank you. Uh, if you if you could give the people a couple words, uh, I want to say thank say, you for letting me in here. We're here. I think more on like the border of Harlem, going into the Heights. We got a ton of people over there. Press, a lot of people here. It's looking good. And uh, we connected with Vish and Lou Valentino, so we got him through. But. Uh, Good. I appreciate you, brother. I appreciate you. That was big. That was a big. That's a big moment. That's a big uh, unifying moment right there. Gracias. All right. I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to get some more stuff out here. In here, everybody's having a drink. But I, I want. I want to. I want to introduce you guys to a special guy right here. I don't know his name, but. I mean, this guy's having the time of his life. He got the Coronas. What's going on, guys? Yo, he's keeping track of the Trump case, and then he just has Trump right here. So he's drinking, having a good time. Tell the people what your name is, man. My name's Richard. Uh, yeah, I hang. I live around here. Yeah. Uh, U.S. Army, former, huge Trump guy. Thank so, you for service, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good to see him, you know? It's good to see it's good you, to see everybody else. It's good to see you having a good yeah, time, yeah. man. <laughs> That's the best. Hold on, guys. I'm going to put my phone on battery saving mode. Give me one second. All right, we're back. Let me know if you guys can hear me. All right, let's go to the anti-Trump crowd one more time here. Yeah, I'm telling y'all, man, this 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 makes me extremely happy because this is where I, I didn't grow up in this neighborhood, but this is what New York looks like. Delis, Mexican restaurants, barbershops, Dominicans, Mexicans, immigrants that put in a lot of work. Um, this is why New York is, is moving in the direction where it's going. And um, I told you guys how I feel about legal and illegal immigration. And I told you guys how I feel about Democrats doing their thing and doing something extremely crazy. But um, yeah, this is what New York looks like, man. And I think Trump coming here is a huge, huge step in the right direction. Let's let's go in here. Let's see let's see what we could do in here. Let let's see let's see what we could do in here. We, this is a Dominican barbershop and beauty salon. Hey, me dijeron que tú vas a votar por Biden. They told me you voted for Biden, bro. 
<risa> yo no, yo quiero cheques. Yo quiero cheques. Cheques mensuales. Cheques mensuales. Mi cuatro cheques. Mira, yo voy a ir trabajando porque. No fue bien en la pandemia que no nos entró. Queremos algo para. Cuando no entró, no fue bien en la pandemia. por ahí. Jordi. Jordi, sí. Let me get a party. Let me get some secret service coming in. This is uh this is Hamilton Heights, aka Harlem Riverside. Um, it's connected to uh, Harlem, but it's really just Riverside. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. Riverside. So it's Riverside. A few blocks away, you got Harlem. The helicopter is here, so that means that Donald Trump should be pretty much on his way over here. And I want to film all of that and get that on tape for you guys as much as I can. If it was up to me, I'd do an interview with Trump. But hey. Of course, we got the one and only Swaino in the building. He got a camera. We're doing a nice little documentary for the people. So stay tuned for that, ladies and gentlemen. I want to show you across the street over there. Yeah, this is this is what it looks like across the street. Uh, everything is barricaded. All the avenues that you can't really drive nowhere. You can't really move nowhere. Um, who knows, man? We might we might just get an interview one day. The sun is blocking, but I wanted to show you some more Sikh service agents. And once again, I want to show you RSBN. RSBN is out here. There's Brian. Brian is always putting in that work, man. Putting that pain. I don't even know where the cameras is at for RSBN, to be honest. All right. So once again, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. We're almost at a thousand likes. If you guys could smash that like button, that'd be dope. Smash that like button. All right, we're going back to the anti-Trump crowd. Let's have some more fun. Esperando a Trump todavía. No ha llegado. Ya viene el helicóptero pasó por ahí ya. Yeah. I want to show you guys some of the, the background here. I'm not sure who they're, who, I'm not, oh, I think that's NBC. It's NBC New York, and then I'm not sure who this is, but it's right. Go home? Nah. I think you might need them. You might need them more than you think, I'm just saying. Nine times, nine times out of 10, you wanna know why I will vote for him? Better economy. Inflation is high right now, isn't it? Okay, let me ask, how much X cost? Yo, how much X cost in there? Let's just, let's just go through the numbers. We can run the numbers right now. How much is that? Oh, uh, $7 for X? Oh, that's crazy. Ooh. That's tough. But you don't, you, you don't mind the hardships as long as that guy doesn't get in. That is. That's what it sounds like. You don't mind going through hard shit as long as he doesn't get in. You're trading. Hey. Okay, tell me the facts. Tell me why. The people want to know why. Okay, let's. It came in hot. It came in hot. It was going in the right direction. Because of COVID, of course, because of COVID. Because of COVID. You're blaming something global? On tr I'm, not, I'm actually giving Biden credit because it was going down. But now it's coming hot again. We cannot keep blaming 2020 for that. I'm just explaining something, okay. but go ahead. No, so if you come in and you create a situation where inflation is high. But you, he didn't create the situation. It's, a, it's COVID. I'm not saying that he created the situation. You just said that. No. You come in, you have a situation where inflation is high. You're not dealing with the high inflation. You're not dealing with that. You're telling, you're telling people to do things that are 
situation. Yeah, but you're dealing now with disinflation. Now, We're bringing so inflation down. On the way down. Oh, on yeah. The, on the way down, which was due to Biden. And now because it takes up and down, people are saying, in closing, in closing, what is your closing argument? Personal, it's personal, always. I don't know him personally. You just said personally. I said, personal, yeah. You just said that. <laughs> but you just used the word, though. Okay, I'm listening. I'm listening. Don't play because I'm finished. I think that my ability to do something who has no type of feelings, who has no type of feelings, who has no type of So it's all personal, is what I'm trying to tell. It's not policy. You're not naming policies, you're naming personally how you feel about them. You just said personally, you're not speaking of personal. Guys, guys, we're going to go around in circles. It's all love. 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 I don't want to go through it. It's all love, guys. It's all love. It's all love. Unity. We need more unity. That's what we need. You don't shake hands, bro? <laughs> that was good. That was fun. All right. I'm seeing helicopters running around. Hey, Manny. Hello, Kat. Si te digo la verdad, como en menos de 15 minutos porque están llegando los, los carros negros y el helicóptero está... Ah, yeah. Se significa que está, está en tráfico también. Pero le doy menos de 20 minutos. <laughs> Damn, I don't even know if my car is still there. Is my car there? Yeah, my car is still there. Yeah, I'm live streaming right now. Got a couple thousand. Just trying to get some the best content possible. That's the deli right there, guys, by the way. The deli is right there. Trump will be coming right here, and he'll go straight in there. And once again, you have crowds over there, crowds there. I don't know. The sun is blocking these people, but yeah, there's a lot of them. Over there. Audio's up, you guys can hear me? I see you on RSBN. Where's RSBN at? I don't even know where RSBN is at. I see I see Brian here, but I don't know where RSBN is at. I see Brian there, but I don't know. I have no idea. Everybody keeps saying they see me, but I don't, I don't know where the camera is at. Please ask the question. Okay. Biden just announced he's raising everyone's taxes. Blue hat. Where's the blue hat? Oh, right there. That says ABC News, though. Behind the camera? I don't know, guys. I'm looking. Once again, we're expecting Trump at any moment now. Traffic in New York City is no joke, though. Coming from the Trump Tower is not no joke as you can see this is what this is what the nyc this is what nyc really is right here the mta <laughs> i wasn't able to get my hat i wasn't able to get anything if i show you guys my outfit hey like, guys i literally ran over here i ran over here thinking i was gonna be late looking for parking and trying to get in here was a hassle um 
So I wasn't able to put anything on. I went, I literally, if you guys don't know, I just did a live stream. I literally just did a live stream. Like, <laughs> and then I ran from the live stream here. You want to talk about hard working. I'm working hard, man. I'm trying to get you the best content possible while also being present. So if you guys want, join the locals and show your support, man. I appreciate y'all. Oh, it's on the right side of the convenience store? Let's see if I find the cameraman. I think it's one of these cameras right here. I think it might be that one. I think it's that one right there. You guys let me know. If you guys can see me, you let me know. Almost at 3,000 in attendance. That's good. Hopefully we get up to more, man. Get everybody in here. This is the best demonetized YouTube channel on YouTube. Look, we got some more people over there too. See, people aren't able, like this thing would have been, um, would have been even more packed, but like I said, um, the barricades are, are, are heavy. Lou, your little brother wants his shorts back. <laughs> Y'all got jokes. Y'all got jokes. It's, bro, it's it's like 70 degrees. Come on. We'll see what uh, how chaotic this thing gets when he gets here. Well, we'll see, because I'm pretty sure everybody's going to want in. Everybody's going to want to try to cross. And I hope I don't I have enough battery life for this. That'll be uh, heartbreaking. So for those who don't know what's going on, Jose Alba um, and the district attorney, um, Alvin Bragg, have a history. Um, Alvin Bragg put Jose Alba in Rikers Island um, after a self-defense case. Um, if you guys never seen the video, you guys should go check out the video uh, at your own. I wouldn't show that on here, but yeah, y'all go check out the video. Go check out the facts of the case and then um, go check out a lawsuit. If I'm not mistaken, Jose Alba sued district attorney. So Trump is playing political chess by coming to the hood, coming into the community where it happened and speaking to Jose Alba face to face um, to show New Yorkers that it's all connected. Because a lot of the people, they don't really even really know uh, what this is. They don't understand what's going on here. Um, this is a Dominican store owner by the name of Jose Alba, who during self-defense, during self-defense, um, Alvin Bragg still tried to put him in Rikers Island. And it was everybody, that should wake up everybody to show you how corrupt New York has become. So. That was two years ago and it's only gotten worse. Yep, it's only gotten worse because they're not trying criminals no more. And if you self-defense, um, Daniel Perry, was that the guy's name? Another self-defense case where Alvin Bragg is trying another uh, innocent person for defending people on a train station. Like, it's just it's just trash right now. New York is trash right now. And then they lie to you and tell you that everything is good. Everything, uh, crime is down, of course. If you look at the statistics, Alvin Bragg, 52% of what used to be crime is now misdemeanors. Um, so, yeah, that's what's going on right now. They want to say what's up to you, man. They, you look like an interesting character. <laughs> Let us know, why are you out here today, man? What's going um, on? I'm a concert violinist, and believe it or not, there are plenty of classical musicians that support President Trump because we've now lived through four years of both, yep. and no one has to wonder which one was better. During, during President Trump, I was working. When the economy is good, musicians work. When the economy falls so apart, so musicians were doing better under Trump than they are right now. Much better, much, much, and much better than we were under Obama, and, and better than we were even under Bush. It was, it was, fa it was fantastic. I was working again, you know, and then it all fell apart. 
and it's getting worse. And you know that I don't, I don't care issue by issue. Just when was your life better? Those four years or these? No one would say their life is better now. That's what it comes down to. You know, I mean, and who kept us out of war? Who got us into wars? Who signed two peace deals with Israel? Who got Israel in a war with Iran? Yep. You know, I mean, we were energy independent. Now we're begging. Begging, yep. It's embarrassing. It is. What's your name, brother? My no, name's no, Gregor no. Kitsis. Lou Valentino. Nice to meet you, brother. Nice God bless. You. God bless. It looks like they're opening it up for Trump, which means that Trump is just moments away from entering. Uh, I'm going to try to get the best view possible. Is there any way I can get beside you, bro? I'm going to try to get right here with you. All right, so we're peaking at 3272 right now as far as people. Once again, Trump will be entering through here. We'll see if he takes any questions. Probably going to take questions from the media on that side. As you can see, at some point, these streets will start closing. I'm going to try to get in here real quick. I'm sorry. I don't want to. I don't want to intrude in your space. I'm gonna try to <clears throat> try to get some people. Look, 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 we're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good. <laughs> so here we go, guys. We're gonna try to. Uh, we're gonna try to get right here. I think this is the best best spot. Maybe we'll get Trump to pull up on us right here. Let me know if I'm too close. Let me know, okay? That's the media behind me right there. There's the cameraman. That's our cameraman right there. That's our guy right there. There you go. They're opening it up. Let's see. Secret Service. This is my first time seeing Secret Service this up close and personal. So I'm just being honest. Damn, so on a tripod would have been nice, bro. I feel like I'm working out. <laughs> All right, guys, just be patient with me. Once again, I'm going to show you guys Brian Glenn, RSBN. There's Brian. Brian got that mad face. After this, I'm going to try to get some more thoughts from um, the individuals uh, out here as well. Uh, afterward. After. But here's the entrance, too. No, no, my bad, my bad. Yeah. <laughs> 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 we support Donald Trump. You hear me, everybody? And we are here to support him. And thank you. <laughs> You supportive too? I know you can't vote yet, but yeah. And my son loves. Oh, where's my son? Oh, he's right here. He's right here. Yo, yo. Nate? If you could vote right now, would you vote for Trump, bro? Yeah. You feel me? That's what's going on out here. We got a two couple. Kids, two kids, only two kids here. <laughs> this is New York City. They probably can vote. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you don't need an ID, I heard. Yeah, that's what I heard. Oh yeah, they're blocking now, guys. Which means that it's probably just a few minutes away. Yeah, kind of. Thank God I'm not over there. Those all those people look depressed. I get to hold my own camera. You're, you're pressed too. You're pressed. You said? Ooh, nah, we stop. I'm, just <laughs> I'm snitching. It's better over here, right? It's more, it's, it's more like the press over there. Like I said, I'm going to keep an eye out on what's going on. So those streets have been closed. Where? You said I hit you? Oh, yeah. Uh, 139th Street. 
West 139th Street, Broadway, Riverside is on the other side. I'm, I think they're hitting the highway up here, or they could be locally hitting the streets, but they're probably coming up. As you can see, the streets, streets have been closed over there too. covering Trump for the last two and a half years. You finally get to see him in person. Yes, sir. Yeah. yeah. Trump, Trump, Trump. Trump. Let's go, Biden. <laughs> Fuck Joe Biden. Say it one more time. Say it louder. Fuck Joe Biden. Let's go, Brandon. The fire truck is behind there as well. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, you know I'm worried about I'm worried about all this shit over here, like. Secret service, look, 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 look. Got him. Whoa! Somebody offered me a beer earlier too. I should have took it. Yeah, right there. Yeah, there's a, yeah. Those are the snipers up there. They're everywhere. I'm telling you. Are those the snipers up there? They ran up. They ran up in that building like like that. Nah, but that that looks like top floor. Yeah. Yeah. I know, but you don't. But if you curse, it's not going to make it. Oh yeah, they have to. Scaffolds? <laughs> that wasn't a part of the... That's a bad spot. <laughs> Next to you know, snipers, snipers, snipers looking. He looking at her like she a threat, boy. <laughs> It's getting tense out here. Yeah. Yeah. Allegedly, five less than five minutes away, but we could be wrong. We're we're just anticipating him. If you haven't smashed that like, smash that like button. <laughs> nah, for those who don't know, huh? Yeah. For those who don't know, huh? 40, oh, almost 4,400. Um, for those who don't know, Trump is visiting Jose Alba's convenience store. This is where an incident where Jose Alba, who is a New York resident, Dominican resident, who owns a deli, uh, ended up getting into an altercation where he took the life uh, by self-defense of a young man. Um, unfortunately, the DA, which is District Attorney Alvin Bragg, who was also trying Trump, uh, he, uh, he basically, that's basically what it is. So he's basically visiting someone who is suing D.A. Bragg, who was thrown in Rikers Island because of self-defense in New York City. So, and I think at some point, Trump is probably gonna visit Daniel Penny as well. 
But that's why he's here. This is not random. This is a political chess move, in my opinion. Bring back wood oven pizza. <laughs> Yo, y'all can see me on RSBN, that's funny. I hear people screaming, I hear people screaming. I hear people screaming. Which way, which way? He's coming up from up the block. Where is he at? Oh, he's coming from down the block, there you go. So that's why they closed that over there. So he's coming from the north. I'm seeing them up close, guys. That's crazy. As you can see, those crowds are screaming for Trump as well. service right there they're looking up everybody in the fire escape in the building so we got the hood over there they happy the hood over there is happy how crazy this thing is getting packed that whole side over there too Highway. 
Tim? They screaming for my boy. They scream. What they say? Go home. <laughs> we gotta go over there right after this. I gotta get an interview. Trump Secret Service right here, getting ready. We got Trump's campaign right here as well. If I'm not mistaken, that's Mr. Miller. Show you a little what's going on over there. Trump, there we go. Here we go. There's the, there's the big guy. There he is with Jose Alba. I don't know if Jose Alba came out. Big trash. show you guys room one more time. Say it, say it, so he can come over here, say it. <laughs> come over here, say come over here. Yes, yes. Mr. Trump, I love you Trump. Trump, we love Trump. 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 Democrats are panicking. Tell your son to say, come jump over here. I know that. Tell him, tell him. Trump, come over here. Tell him, come over here. Tell him, come over here. Tell him, tell him. Tell him, tell him. Come over here. Tell him. Say, I love you, Trump. Tell him, come over here. Come over here. Trump, 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 Trump. Service is looking at. 
Oh, We're looking over there. Look. Oh, there's a drone? Oh, a drone right here. That's, that's a... Once again, let me show you what's going on a little to the right of me. There they go, they're screaming, chanting Trump. <laughs> we need you, bro. You gotta, you gotta yeah, do this for us. Cause you gotta do this for us. We need you. You gotta keep telling us. You gotta tell Trump you love him so he could come, bro. Come on. Okay, but don't you stand there. There's another drone up there too. I don't know if you guys can see it. Is it? Okay, okay. Whoever's doing that. Stop screaming. I think that's Jason Miller right there. Yeah, that could be Trump's campaign. Trump is a what? Sebastian. <laughs> hey, yo, shut the fuck up! <laughs> of course, y'all look like lesbians. Hopefully we get him over here. Trump, that reporter, she's the worst. I think she's from MSNBC. Excuse me, can you move a little distance? I'm sure because I can't see you. Thank you. Are oh, you still in my way or her way? Like, Yo, NYPD, my boy, you gotta do the people a favor, you heard? You wanna be liked in the city? You gotta do your thing, you heard? Thank you. Thank you. You wanna be the most loved, you don't wanna be the most hated, you heard? I'm 
Pero si, si, si yo no puedo meter aquí, yo no puedo llamar y a ver si quiero meter aquí. Deja que mire para acá, entonces yo lo hago. Porque este no está aquí. Yo, camping. Why are you winning him? Tap, tap him, tap him. Tap that guy. Yeah, yeah. Yo, yo. Try to get him over here. You can finesse that. Try to, you... Excuse me, my son, my son, my son. <laughs> you got the power, bro. You got the suit on. <laughs> Yo, Trump, come get some questions from the people. The people want to talk. We want to tell you everything we know. Trump, 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 Yo, Trump! Trump! Yo! Why so proudly we hail at the twilight's last gleaming surprise. Here we go! I don't even know what part they're in. Last gleaming. And the rocket's regular. Bombs bursting in They proved through the night That our flag was still there There we go! Oh, say the star star-spangled banner Yeah! There we go, Trump! And the home of the great USA, 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 USA. USA. We started USA. one. Just say, call him and say you love him. I didn't know what part they were in, guys. I kept trying to sing along with them, but they were singing the Dominican anthem, a little mix, uh, the remix. They started it right here. Beautiful young black women. They started singing the national anthem. We are his fans, not the press. They're his haters. They're his haters. We love him. That's true. They're the fake news. 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 Trump! Damn. 
We'll get them next time, kids. He's shaking the hands up the NYPD right now. <laughs> Yo, Trump campaign, come on, man. Y'all gotta make the magic happen, dog. Y'all gotta make it happen. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> don't cry, bro. Don't cry. Don't look at look at your eyes. You don't like it. Trump! Oh, he's officially gotten in the vehicle. Go ahead, go ahead. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Look at him right there and come. Yeah, if you guys can't super chat, just join the locals, man. Support the channel, man. You guys can't super chat, but hopefully one day you can. But hit the hit the locals for sure. He's in this car right here. This is the closest we ever been to 45, man. That's tough. Trump! Yes, sir. Yeah, he's waving. He's waving. All right, we'll get the crowd's reaction now. Here we go. Let's get the crowd's reaction right here. Yeah! Trump! Trump! Let's go! Trump! Yo! The only anti-Trumpers happen to be white. Just a few blacks, just a few Dominicans, everybody, every, all the Dominicans for Trump. The only people with the sign are the white liberals. Let's go. Wow, what an event, guys. All right, I'm going to take you around as soon as these barricades open up. I'm going to take you. Hey, we got my Dominican guy right here. Come on, man. Yo, we hit five. Yo, five we went crazy. We went crazy today, y'all. Oh, yeah, I'm going to walk, I'm gonna walk around the hood right now. We're going to get people's reactions. We look at the reaction of the people. The only people protesting Trump are white liberals. Losers. Fuck out of here. Oh, we can't even come out through here? Oh, shit. Yo, yo, you like, you, you came over here for Trump? <laughs> ah, yeah, yo, this is, uh, I'm trying to, as soon as they open up these barricades, uh, as soon as they open up these barricades, I'm going to go around the hood. We're going to get people's reactions. Go with the hood reaction. Is there any way I can get out? Thank you. Yeah. Appreciate you. Yo. you interview people, mm -hmm. what you got to do is you got you to find out who can vote for Trump. A lot of who people can say, vote? Who can vote? A lot of people that can't vote. Can't vote. Because they're not registered. True. They got to register. Yeah, they got to register so, to vote. Yeah, yeah, you know, let that also be known. For sure, bro. Thank well, you. I'm listening to you and I think that's the only thing you can Nah, we got to register people. That's a fact. We do. Appreciate you, brother. We got to do a register campaign out here in the hood. All right, yeah, we're going to walk around. We're going to see what's up, see what's popping out here in these streets. I want to talk to some of the anti-Trumpers. Matter of fact, I'm going the wrong way. Yo, that way, that way. My car's over there. It's double parked. My car's double parked. Let's see if it's still there, guys. Here we go. Let's talk to some of the people. Let's try. I'm going to try to go get RSBN. You should, you should hold this, hold this. Bro, I can, this, this, this is heavy, bro. It's too heavy? Yo, stop talking to me. Let's go to RSBN real quick.
Here we go. The most famous man. This is uh, this is Brian Glenn. We're gonna, we're gonna get him as soon as he turns around. Here we got Newsmax right there. Hey, Yo! <laughs> Yo, you did me a huge solid. We got over 5,000 people watching. Brian this Glenn. This guy right here. As soon as, all I needed was this, and they let me in. That's awesome. Because I was going to be on the other side with the That's inside awesome. truckers. I appreciate no, you. No, man. God bless I, you so I, much. I told bro. him, I said, my friend over there is a true patriot. Yes, sir. You, you got you to gotta let him in there. He'll support the president. Yeah. He'll stream. He's got a great audience right there. You see him, I think, got a ton of viewers right now. No, so that's what I wanted to do. I'm so happy no. you guys came to the hood, man. I cannot hey. wait. I, I, I hope, and when you get a chance, please tell them we need a rally in the Bronx. A rally in the Bronx, guys. Let's fucking make it happen. Excuse my language. Let's make it happen. Yeah, I, I, this is what this is what it would look like. A bunch yep. of Dominicans, a bunch of Puerto Ricans, everybody coming out because they want to unify with Trump. And what's what's That's interesting it. is is I heard. Hey, hello. How are you? How you doing? How are you doing? <laughs> I'm Brian. Nice to meet you. I can think of music me for. No, 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 not right now. Hang Come on. on. Hang on. I wanted to be no. Uh, I, I, I want to get your honest opinion. I heard 90% cheers. There was yeah. a few clowns out there that were booing. Can I be honest with you? But All the Dominicans, everybody out here in these streets, Dominican, are Dominican, Dominican for Trump. For Trump. All you saw the were, excuse president. my language, no, no. the white liberals that live somewhere around here or somewhere yeah. downtown coming up here, the same F Palestine people. Once again, everybody in New York is voting for Donald J. Trump. Now, one thing I want to tell people is, we got to get people registered. We got to get people registered because a lot of people are interested in voting, but they don't even know how to. So we're, that's that's my next step here in the uh, in the Bronx and yeah. in Harlem and in with every borough. That's good. You got to get registered to vote. Hey, register. Man. Yo, keep, Brian, keep you're thing, the man. man, dog. Keep doing your thing. Thank you for today. It. I appreciate you. That's Brian it, Glenn, guys. Woo! We're making it happen out here. All right, my car, it's still there, guys. My car is still there. Look at that. This is, this is what I try to tell my white liberal friends or my black liberal friends or my Dominican liberal friends. This is something you can't comprehend. The Dominican flag and the, and the Dominican flag and the American flag, they can't comprehend that. That's different. They can't comprehend it. People got to get with the program. It's Trump 2024, bro. Like, just get with it. Just get with it. All right, let's go walk around and let's, let's ask some people how they feel about this. Yo, we this, are here. I can't believe we got in there. I'm gonna be honest. What is this? Trump dildos on sale? What? No. Hey, yo! What are y'all selling? Hey, yo! You shouldn't even be holding that. Trump dildos? Hey, fucking yo! Hey, yo! Let's, let's. Hey, yo! Dildos! Yo, I got mad liberal people coming over here. They, they want those Trump dildos inside of them right now. Yes, sir! <laughs> yo, give all the liberals that Trump dildo! <laughs> yo! How you doing, bro? How you doing? What? Oh, yeah. This is her district where just out here making everyone. Whose district oh, is this? Oh, yeah, no, yeah, District 30, Center Court Down here. Okay, so what do you do? I run her in the local town. Okay, what is she? Republican, Democrat? What is she? Democrat. She's a Democrat? But I consult her. I, I, I'm independent. You're independent? Well, I'm not a Democrat. Yeah, we're on the right side of the world. We're on the right side of the world. But you're in her district. This is the people's district, boy. Yeah. <laughs> you must not know. Nah, I'm just playing. Well, my name's Blue. Happens, my name's Blue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome. I appreciate you uh, shaking my hand and, and reaching out. I would just say, if you guys are going to be outside, please be safe. Uh, I appreciate you, bro. I See, why, they, why can everyone be like that? Yo, what is this, though? What is going on here? What is going on you're, in your you're, district? You're running this, right? What is going yeah. on in your district? They're just branding and marketing. <laughs> no, that's dope. That's great. That's actually really good. They must have made that. They must have made that today. Trump dildos, let's go! <laughs> Yo, so, so you're independent though. I'm a you're a Trump supporter. I'm a 
I don't talk about who pays anymore. I just talk about who pays. <laughs> Yeah, I wish you had a card on you, man. Uh, yeah, go get your stuff. Who knows? Maybe we can unite with some of these Democrats and get some of these Trump dildos. <laughs> there you go. Uh, I don't use the Instagram, but just reach out to me on this page. But I have my uh, my YouTube channel, Lou Valentino. Yeah, we got a the senators and my candidates are trying to expand. Well, I'm not going to endorse Democrats, but are we down to uh, have a conversation with some Democrats? And why not? And see, have a conversation and see what we can change, see what we can come in and unite, you know? But uh, I've definitely been trying to reach out to more of the politicians in New York. You know all of them? That's amazing, bro. Yeah, this is even better right here. Yo, guys, text me, text me. Guys, this is the best part. Yeah! Trump dildos! Hey yo! Hey yo! Yo, I got your number, yo. Yeah? I've never seen so many people excited for a dildo. Hey yo! Yo, where the liberals at? Where's the liberals? We got dildos for you. Yeah, we got the dildos, yeah! <laughs> fuck, fuck Trump, but you want a dildo in your mouth, hey yo! <laughs> Let's go liberals, get all your dildos. Where's the liberals at? Come get the dildos. Get the dildos. Go get it. You don't want dildo? You don't want dildo? <laughs> Yo, this is insane. No, they got Trump dildos. You guys want that? For all my liberal friends, you get lonely at night because you don't believe in marriage and you want some help. Go get your Trump dildos right there. Here you go, romantic department. Yeah! <laughs> Alright guys, I'm out, I'm out. All right. This is this is getting rated PG not 13. We gotta go. But I told you guys this is what happens. This is what happens. Um in New York City. It turns stupid like this. Dale Dose for Trump, bunch of kids outside. But I, we met this guy who works for Democrat senators. So I wanna have some questions for him. Maybe we'll do some meetings and stuff like that. But yeah, this was a successful uh, live stream. I appreciate everybody joining. Harry did not come here. Harry did not come here. Unfortunately, Harry did not come. But once again, I want to show you this right here. Dominicans and American flag. That's, that's what dreams are made of right there, man. So in closing, I appreciate everybody coming in. Gavin's right there. I got to link up with Gavin, Young Republicans oh, Club and... Yo, the footage liberals, we got today is crazy, man. Liberals losing their minds out here. Dildos for Trump, screaming. Like, you know what's crazy about this? You know what's crazy about this? But in closing, liberals come to every event that's about Trump and they just have to make their presence known. They can't show up and just chill. Just vibe. Just vibe. You might get some knowledge. You might not like what they're saying, but you just got to chill. In this predicament, you got a bunch of people coming out yelling and everybody just went home. So. I appreciate everybody. Yeah, you gotta register people. Yeah, that, that's a, that's another good thing. Another good thing about you guys 
is that you guys open my mind up. What if we do a voter registration situation, right? Where a lot of people want to vote for Trump. They say Trump 2024, but they're not registered. They're not registered to vote. So that was something that some guy came up to me. He was like, yo, you should try to get people registered. A lot of these people don't even know. They're not even registered. So you register everybody you can, man. Let people know it's an important election. The other side says that this is the end of democracy. We are saying a whole nother thing. Vote for your best candidate. I think this might be the most important uh, situation. So help them vote online. Yeah. I'm so thirsty. This was a crazy live stream. Yo, the dildo part, I know it was inappropriate because we had kids there, but it just shows you how retarded New York is. <laughs> it just shows you like, get all the liberals over there. All the liberals. <laughs> like what? Who comes up with that? <laughs> That's insane. Well, that's so New York, though. New York is crazy like that. And I grew up here, so can't tell you that it's not funny because it is. It's hilarious. But it's also, oh, that guy came up to you. He was like, yo, um, I, I work with all the senators and I'm a mental health advocate. I need that. He said like, he's a mental health. Like, he, he specializes in mental health. Yeah, 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 yeah. He need, like, Democrats, liberals. Like, that's they mental that. health shit. Yeah. They need that. But he's literally partying with the dildos. They don't wake up on the right side of the bed. That's why. And they made that banner in less than like. <laughs> they made that. At Yo, minutes. how? Because nobody knew he was gonna be here. I found out a little earlier. Um, I got an article, but they made the, they made it so fast. Crazy, crazy, crazy. It is. It was funny for those who didn't find it funny. I want to apologize. I know I have a lot of grown adults and people that are not used to that type of content. That, that rated X. So I want to apologize if I showed that on camera. But I was just showing you guys what New York turns into uh, and what New York is. So um, it's hilarious. I laugh at these things. I, I might show these things, but I might cut that part out if I can. But I apologize to those who were offended by that. I hope you guys weren't offended by that. You guys know we're in New York. We're live streaming. Shit could get out of hand at any moment. So I don't want you guys to take it personal. Um, and I don't want you guys to be offended. But dildos for Trump is just too funny. You got to record that. And you got to record liberals being so dumb enough to like go party with them. <laughs> Yo, Lou. Liberals! But I love, love everybody. That's fire. Jeez. All right, guys. I love y'all so much, man. We literally, before closing, I literally did a live stream speaking about everything earlier and then got in the car and ran over here and told my mans right here to come, to come and, and, um, and meet me over here. I gotta go get my car. Is my car still there? Oh shit, hold on, hold on guys. It's not funny? Okay, I'm sorry. I, I, didn't, mean, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean, you know, it's just funny to me. But. Once again, if, if y'all were offended by that, my apologies, but sorry. All right, my car is still there, guys, so we're good. We're, we're good. We're good to go. All right, so I want to say it was funny. Like, what do y'all feel like, you know, if you, if you were offended by that, my bad, man. Just don't don't follow me. My bad. You know, but I'm, I'm just showing you everything that's going on out here. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I'm about to cut it off right now. All right. Come on. You guys complain about liberals being, like, mad and sensitive. Don't don't be sensitive about something that I showed on stream that's happening right here. Oh, gosh. I'm over here like it. Ah, whatever. I'm out, guys. Now you guys are making me feel terrible. All right. I love y'all. Hit the like button if you haven't. Um, and uh, I will see you guys in the next. And also, please, if you can... Join the locals community for free. You guys can pay if you want. You guys don't have to, but I would truly appreciate you guys if you guys go to the locals. And I am going to keep covering what's going on in the streets. Now more than ever, we're going to cover the New York shift. I call it the New York shift. See what's going on out here in these streets. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys on the next one.